When I'm riding through your hood, east side, be with me. So the pole at his chromosome, me with me. I'm back. Any nigga got a problem with that? What's good, YouTube? It's your boy T, and I'm back with another video, man. And today, we're going to be talking about Charleston White and T.I. Alright, so look, man. Now, I made a video about a week ago uh, at the uh, Juicy Fruit. Shout out to Juicy. She's a female rapper out of Memphis, Tennessee. She's really good. Go check her out if you haven't. But she dropped her new song called Step, and it featured uh, T.I. And on this song, T.I. went off on uh, Charleston White. And in my opinion, that's exactly what Charleston White wanted. This is not a game you can win with him. It's almost like a, a 6 9 You see how he was getting the better of everybody he was beefing with? But when it came to Lil Dirt, Lil Dirt didn't even mention that dude. He just sneaked this to him a few times and act like he didn't even exist. And that's literally the only way you could win against 6 9 And here with Charleston White, I feel it's the same way. If you respond to Charleston White, he's already won. You fell in the trap. So after Charleston White heard his diss song from T.I., he went and recorded his own diss song. Y'all heard it right, man. Charleston White is now a rapper. Of course, it's for comedic purposes, but he is releasing a new song. Yeah, the nigga said I wasn't on this level. He put me on this level, and I blew past He talking about how he gonna snitch on all of these rappers that he beefing with, bragging about getting people dope spots hit up. And if you're not familiar with that, uh, it's a studio out in uh, Dallas, Texas. That Charleston White got shut down because some local Dallas rappers allegedly was doing more stuff than just booking studio time. Let's just say that. So again, Charleston White dropping a diss track towards T.I. and all of these other rappers. And you know what's going to be crazy? His song is going to get more views than their song. Embarrassing, right? It is going to be embarrassing. But hey, that's what happens when you play these games with... Uh, this is this is Charleston White's arena, man. This is like going to pick a fight with Mike Tyson in the boxing ring. Going back and forth on social media against Charleston White, you're going to lose. I mean, look at Soldier Boy. He's one of the undisputed <laughs> champions of uh, social, social media. Charleston White even got him. So at the end of the day, Charleston White isn't taking these guys serious, man. Now don't get me wrong, T.I. is mad as hell. But Charleston White, he he's just clowning. He's not taking this social media stuff serious. But like T.I. said, eventually y'all are going to meet face to face. And just make sure you have your mate. That's what T.I. said, not me. But anyway, man, how y'all feel about this? Let me know in the comment section, bro. Like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification bell, man. Hey, man, follow me on Instagram. A TZF baby. Two five two. But I'm gone. Prolific. Hey. Bitch, I'm in the streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in the streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in the streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in the streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in the streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in the streets.